the second program is write a pattern program to get unique values from a list so this is a little trickier program that we are going to solve in today's lecture so we need to find unique values what do you mean by unique values let's go to the jupyter notebook and we will do it by practicing we're going to find program to find unique values unique values in the list list for example we have a list of numbers so this these are the numbers you can see that there are repeated value for example one is repeated for example three times and similarly six is repeated two time and i mean there are uh repetition in some values so what we're doing we'll, we'll try to find only unique values in a list so we will need to create an other list okay we need to create an other list to store that unique values so what is the method to check we will what we'll do we will go one by one using loop to all number and we will be storing it it uh, that number into an other list okay and other list uh, now i will uh, tell you another method to add a number to a list okay so now we're going to learn it so what is the logic logic is that we will go to all the number in the list one by one and we will add this number to a list but on the condition that if old list already contain that number for example first i will be going to the one i will add to the list okay then i will go to the two i will add to list then three add to list then again when i go to the two it should not add that to the list because two is already added in the list so this is the logic we will be adding with the condition that if it already present in the list or not i will create unique okay unique list name unique and there are two methods to create list i can make it like this list or i can make it like this using braces okay you should know these both method so let's create a using list okay list function i can write this this is empty list okay now i will uh, loop to, to in the number for number in number it is a method to loop into the list okay uh, if you don't know about loops i have a complete video about that so i am uh, creating a loop on the numbers what i will check i will check that if number in uh, we have to check that if number is not in that unique list okay if number is not in unique list if number not in remember we learned a function not in not in is you to check that if number is not present in uh, something i'm checking if number is not in unique okay if that number not in unique what i will do i will add that number to the unique how what is the method unique is equal to unique plus unique is going to unique plus I will add brackets and with them I will add number this is a another method to add a number to the list okay another method you know append okay append is another method but I can add this this is alternative to append method okay so if number is not in unique I will add unique is to unique plus number now everything is clear let's check it uh, our unique numbers I will uh, now print the results so how i will print i will go to the loop for a number in now i will check in unique list in unique in unique you can say a print print unique numbers are unique numbers are now it will only print unique number it should not repeat the number you will say print print number now i will tell you another thing let's first check out the output okay look it only printed the unique number 1 2 3 4 5 6 8 9 and 11 it does not printed a repeated number it means that whatever unique number are presented in the numbers list now it is added as a unique number in unique list okay if i want to print all these number in a single line because you can see print statement whatever we uh, add in the print statement it print and it go to the another line okay so uh, if we don't want to go to the new line and i want to print everything in a single line i need to write comma and i need to write and is equal to and is equal to you need to write space okay and is equal to space like that now if i will print it, it you can see that it is all printed in a single line so that was about today's lecture we have completed two uh, three three of the programs in our playlist 
and uh, two of them I uh, we did two day and two of them uh, actually uh, the, we did one and uh, another was similar like smallest number and one of the program I gave you as a home task was about uh, finding sum of all the numbers in a list if you did find any difficulty in that please like, comment as we will try to make video on it as soon as possible to guide you I hope you enjoyed today's video uh, take care and we will meet in the next video bye bye Thank you.